Welcome to De-Stress Chiropractic. In this video, we will be observing Nicole as she performs the Fakuda test. Patients turn towards the site of dysfunction. Nicole has PTSD and I am directing therapy towards her vestibular canals in an attempt to turn down the intensity of her symptoms. How's your stress? How's your body? How's your mood? My stress has been pretty high, but manageable. My regular sore and the neck. Okay. All right, let's go check your bounce. Ready? Hands out. March in place for me. Nicole initially looks normal. However, she soon starts to turn to the left. This is indicating a left-sided issue. As with all my videos, I have edited the length of the exam and treatment for brevity purposes. Therapy will initially be directed towards Nicole's left side of her body. Oh. You okay? Yeah. Did you get more? Yeah. Mm. Oh. In an attempt to fire through her ipsilateral oh. spinal cerebellar pathways to affect her left cerebellum. After her initial treatment, I will re-examine her primitive reflexes to make certain they Good. normalize. Turn your head left. Push out. Keep your head there. Push out. Good, head the other direction, push out. Good, keep your head there, push out. Okay, go walk for a second, you ladies, see how you feel. Okay. How's that? Good, I feel like, not heavy, but like grounded. Yeah, like lighter. Yeah. Let's try your test again. After stimulating her left cerebellum with the left-sided adjustments, her right side appears diminished in its capacity to the left. When re-performing the Fakuda test, now she turns right. You can pause, eyes open. That's weird. As we fine tune her nervous system, these things are going to pop up. We're going to fix one area of dysfunction and in the process, other areas that appeared normal previously will now look abnormal. Once again, new issues pop up. Nicole's turning left again. I will have her perform a finger to nose exercise and then re-perform the Fakuda test. I like the precision bow, I should go a little faster. All right, let's try your test again. March in place for me. Now Nicole stays directed forward. This is normal. Good job. You went side to side, but you stayed at least in place. Oh. Go walk and try that. Like lifted everything. Better? Yeah. Okay. <sighs> One more, we're gonna do your hip on the other side. Oh. <sighs> Got warm? Go walk, see what. Mm. That's a big one. Calmer, right? Yeah. <laughs> I want you better. Come. Thank you. Come here, How are you? Let's check, check in. I'm doing really well. You've been doing your spins? Yes, just a few times. I feel like at least three times a day. As a part of Nicole's rehab, I've been having her perform spinning to the left to stimulate her left-sided horizontal canal in an attempt to turn down the intensity of her PTSD symptoms. Mm -hmm. And that's making you feel better? I don't know if it, I would say making me feel better. Like a little bit more grounded, I, I suppose. I've just been having a lot of stressors. You said you woke up on the right side of the bed today. Yeah, I just woke up in a good mood. And it was funny because on the drive over here, I was just like, oh, and I get to be, get treated and feel better, you know? Yeah. Um, and I was like, the wor world's kind of crumbling around me, but it's okay. How's your sleep been? Poor. Staying up three or four in the morning. Now, is this because you're on phones or because of life or? I mean, I turn, I put my phone away, the TV's on. I'll even get up to get a snack or. What time do you wake up in the morning? Actually not, never past like 8.39. Have we talked about triggers in diet? Diet, yes, triggers, no. Let's go check your bounce. Heal the toe, let's see what you got. Hands by your side. Hands by your side. There you go, keep coming. Dang. Feel very unstable. Eyes closed, march in place for me. Now while performing the Fakuda test, it displays as normal. This is a good sign. 
This is a modified Moreau test, also known as the Star Reflex test, and Nicole passes it <laughs> when she previously did not. This is a good sign. Nicole, you're, you're still cold, though. I'm freezing. When I examine patients, I test their hands and feet, and this tells me the, the temperature that they're exhibiting. When a patient's cold like this, it tells me there's some type of circulation or thyroid issue, so we'll usually discuss environmental triggers. Is this all the time? Push up. Um, my feet and hands, yes. Give me your synopsis of what you ate yesterday. I had a little bit of pasta. Well, there's our wheat. I had oatmeal. There's our cross of. I had coffee. There's our cross of. I had, I had some fruits. And fruits are fine. Let's consider it's no wheat and no coffee. What? Yeah. Coffee can be a crossover contaminant for you. How much coffee are you having? I mean, just two, and then I'll, I switch to decaf. Yeah, but how long do you do the decaf? Kind of all day. It's more of I'm drinking the coffee for the taste. Now, you know decaffeinated coffee has caffeine in it. You do know that, right? You do know that, right? Nicole. I do now. <laughs> it has less caffeine. I'll tell you what. Let's do one recommendation. Let's cut out all coffee for a week. Whoa. Let's cut out all coffee for a week and see if you can go to bed early. Ooh, my neck has been a little extra stiff recently. So that felt nice. Well, caffeine might be the clincher for you, actually. Your balance is good. It's not great, but it's good. Your Fakuda test is good. You're feeling better. You're doing your turns. Yes. I think if we just simply cut out your caffeine, let's see what happens. Okay. We need to get your sleep patterns to be a little more normal. Yeah, it's horrible. I feel like I'm delusionally tired running on crazy energy. And then you do more caffeine. Go walk. Ugh. How's that feel? Um, feels loose. I'm not really thinking about anything else. I feel light. Yeah. Oh, gosh. Now go walk and try that. <sighs> Light. Roll towards me. We're going to do your ilium. I had shown Nicole a previous video where she makes this noise oh. after treatment, which is very oh. common for patients to do. In this video, she's trying to suppress that response. Oh, I can think of that, the noise. That's okay. <laughs> totally fine. Roll one to say. That was a big one, though. <sighs> now let's go to the walk. Okay. How's that? Mobile. Feel. Feel calmer? Yeah, a lot more calmer and grounded and... Thanks, Nicole. Yes. <laughs> if you are suffering from a complex health issue, give our office a call today.